We're gonna talk about time management today and we're gonna talk about it vlog style because I'm not perfect at this. Like, I'm not even super skilled. I actually <laughs> struggle between like my not wanting to waste time and then laziness. So it's this weird mix of I'll go, 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 but then I'll get super overwhelmed and I'll just do nothing. Um, and so I just wanna share with you guys some of the tricks and random things that I employ to make myself get stuff done because um, managing time isn't easy. And I don't know, I guess the biggest thing that I would pass on is don't have guilt if you mess up one day, just start fresh the next day. So I'm just sitting in my office. Penny is right there. Hi, Cookie. What you doing? What you doing? You look so short. So short, and I am mocking you. You're so cute, though. We'll talk later, Penny. We'll talk later. Anyway, I'm sitting in my office. That's my outline. And, oh, and there's copies of Pearl's number and Evelyn's number. Um, <clears throat> just, you know boldly hinting at the giveaway going on right now. I don't know, I'll flash a picture or something. But anywho, I thought I would just share with you some of the random things that I've been trying. Um, and it helps me to mix it up, like, cause if you get into a habit of breaking a habit, then the thing doesn't work anymore. So I'll just share with you some things that I'm trying right now. And the first one is actually like to plot everything out on paper and like get it written down like my goals and my plan for the day. So I'm gonna show you, sometimes I don't do this super intense and sometimes I don't follow it, but I'm gonna show you my most intense version um, today. So yeah, let's look at that. I'm gonna try to hold the camera well while still writing. We'll see how this goes. So, whoops, I, I am not like a perfect bullet journaler by any means. I just sort of slap it on there. If I'm ever actually in the mood to do like a pretty doodle, I would do like, um, I would do something like, like while I'm watching a show, let's see if I can find it here. Something like this that I totally got off Pinterest. This is my like bookshelf. But for right now, today, oh, that's a nice spot. I'm just gonna do something real simple. So typically what I like to do if I'm doing more of a casual day is I'll just do like check boxes. I like to be able to check them off and I'll just do, you know, oh gosh, if I was really trying to be like prettier, I would do all caps or something. Um, what else do I have to do today? I'm just gonna run through this real quick. Okay, so you can see that I got a lot of videos. Today is filming day. I'm on this one right now, and that's why I have my face on. And then I have mailing packages, reading Save the Cat Tree Fresh as I work on writing a scene, and a couple other random things. And then what I'm gonna do is normally this is all I do, to be honest, um, and then <laughs> sometimes I don't even stick to it. But it, if I, you know, am on a regular day, I'll just work on this as much as I can and then I'll move what I can't over. I'll do like an X if I've done it or an arrow forward if I need to move it to the next day. But in this case, let's say, let's go to my um, extremely not productive day. I'm gonna put like a cute little heart or something here. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing. Do, do, do. Okay, anyway, that looks stupid. I am not a bullet journaler, but anyway, I would do like um, literally breaking it down by times. And so, not gonna lie, I sleep in on Saturday. So, <laughs> basically, wake up and get ready. Um, and then, what I'll do is I'm gonna give myself an hour to kind of wake up because I hate mornings, like, hate mornings. So, I'm like, still waking up right now but anyway so let's start off the day and i'll pull over things like this um film oops video number one and then i'll just break the day into um what do you call these half hour chunks this is so scribbly, I apologize guys. But yeah, I'm just basically going to like, for instance, after I film a vlog, maybe I'll post um, to Instagram and take a break. Um, and then I think I'll need to keep filming and kind of knock it out. So film video number two, 
film video number three. And then, you know, this is super late, but a lunch and a break would be nice here. Um, packages and groceries, prep for the live, and then live on Patreon, and I'm pretty sure that'll continue and live and take a break. But you, you get the idea, like I'm just gonna keep filling it out. I'm gonna keep pulling from this side, moving it to that side, and I'm gonna literally say what I'm gonna do throughout the day, and then this will be a 25 minutes on, as in working, five minutes off. So each half hour, I break it up into that little program, and so this just gives me a little much needed break. That's supposed to be a heart. We're gonna move on now. <laughs> so that's my bullet journal, and that is actually something I got from Michaels for five bucks. So I get like all my journals at Michaels now because they're super cheap. They're usually five bucks, at least over here in Minnesota. So I don't know, sometimes if I'm even like really struggling and I just, I'm feeling overwhelmed and I know the to-do list is too long and that is making me not do anything, which happens a lot actually then my trick there is to like number and I should have shown you this but to number like the top three priorities so like to put one two and three by three things in the journal and sometimes I cheat and I do like a fourth one but that way I know like screw the other stuff I need to focus on this and at least get this done like what is the most important thing and you know like today mailing packages and the live on patreon because like my monthly lives I need to show up to that and obviously I will and so like if the writing doesn't get done today that's okay but at least some things need to get done right so that helps me to put a one two three priority and then another thing I'll do is use timers. And again, you saw how everything's broken down into a half an hour portion. So I don't know, it just like, the reason that I have the half an hour portions is usually because I know I need to set a timer. And if I'm really motivated and having a good day, one of those rare days, then I don't need to set a timer, but I should not be showing you my outline. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, but anyway, if I'm really motivated, then I don't need it, but on a like not so good day, I will literally set timers until I like get in the groove or the whole day, depending. <laughs> this shoulder is so weird. Uh, like I mentioned, I try to write things down and I just, I remember hearing a quote somewhere, you could probably look this up on Google, but there's like a statistic about how much more likely you are to actually do something if you write it down. So I write everything down because I'd forget anyway. And I think the last thing that I wanted to mention was how um, being consistent is key. So like I'll, if I try something and I decide to do some thing, you know, anything at all to help me manage my time, then I try to do it consistently and develop a habit and not give up on it because like if you just try a bunch of random things but you never stick to one, you'll never form a habit. It takes a while to form a habit. I don't know, I hope that helps you guys. I am by no means a pro and again, I feel like I just need to say don't guilt yourself for what's happened in the past because the past is done. Like focus on today, focus on the future. Um, I guess I should add one more tip. This is like off the top of my head, I didn't write this down, but um, once you've kind of mapped out big picture, <clears throat> whether it's like the next year and you need to like zoom in and focus on today or if it's like everything today you need to zoom in and focus on the one task whatever you do I say like zoom in and focus and have like one thing on your mind like if it's like the one day versus the whole year or like one task in the day versus all the stuff on your to-do list I feel like it helps to just narrow your focus to just like less and so it's good to like get the big picture but once you have the big picture figured out like narrow it down <laughs> I don't know I feel like that helps me let me know if any of this is something that you would like to try and would help you <laughs> you can't tell right now because the lighting's good but I am breaking out like crazy like so bad the closer we get to release which is so close now of Pearl's number the more I break out so I'm compensating by doing cute eye makeup and stuff so that I feel good about myself. But speaking of the book release, the 
uh, first book, Evelyn's Number, is on like a discount sale all the way up through the release day. So go grab your copy now and pre-order Pearl's Number. It's like the best deal ever. And if you do pre-order Pearl's Number, I do have that giveaway that I mentioned. And the giveaway is pretty sweet because no matter what, you get an amazing, snazzy, beautiful book in the mail at the end of it. But you could also win a signed copy of one of the other books or a candle based on one of the books or an Amazon $10 gift card, whatever you choose. Like there's one winner each week. Actually, hold up. This this point I think there's two left and one of them is the grand prize giveaway at the end so anyway I hope you guys like this vlog I've never really done a vlog before no I did that it's not true I did one once um, and it was really fun and I got to hang out with Penny more let's have a Penny moment here we go just to say bye we'll hang out with Penny hi who is that Penny who are the lovely people hey focus she says, there's squirrels outside. I really, really, really need to catch that squirrel <gasps> and that other squirrel. Oh my gosh, there's so many squirrels. What are we gonna do? I'm freaking her out. Penny and I hope you have an amazing day. We hope that your nanoing is going well and we will talk to you again very soon, like tomorrow. So I'll talk to you then. Give this video a thumbs up you don't have any thumbs and make sure that you subscribe if you like this so that you can watch more more blah, more videos and I'm getting a little distracted here ah, don't bite don't bite okay I'll let you go and anyway I hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll talk to you again very soon bye